What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. It is the weekend. Does that mean I'm gonna do a non-gaming video where I talk about my interests, my life, maybe do some rants, rambling, anything that is really kind of personal-ish and that is non-gaming. So last week, I know I meant to do non-gaming videos and last week I did a commentary over a gaming video, which is kind of weird. But what I, what I mean by non-gaming is like non-live commentary. Like the gaming part is not the focus of the video. The focus of the video is what I'm saying. So that's why um, you might be a bit confused where I said like weekends I'll do like non-gaming life videos where I just talk to you guys about anything but I have a gameplay in the background even though it said non-gaming but that, I mean non-gaming is although gaming is not the focus of the video or like the Deadpool video that's the main focus showcasing the game, playing it, having fun. Anyways, not important. This video is going to be totally about my opinion again this is the type of videos that i want to, wanted to do like these video, this video i'm making right now is, type, is the video where i share my opinion about stuff and you guys can give me your opinions in the comments stuff i really like making these videos i might do them in a vlog format like this or i might do them over a game commentary like i did last time anyways i'm really late to the party when I'm talking about this certain subject is reactors so if you guys are living under a rock or do not use youtube regularly you guys know there was this huge drama with this YouTuber called Grady Underay. I love him. Like, he's really awesome. A great YouTuber. He's getting really big right now. He speaks the truth about everything in a really funny and comedic and satire way. Um, he speaks the truth about the problems of YouTube and just funny comedic videos and stuff. You, should, you guys should really check him out. He's really funny. He gets a lot of controversial um, talk regarding his videos because of the way he's outspoken and opinionated but personally i like people who are the, who, about that but not people who like of course are being like d-bags so yeah he's pretty cool youtuber you guys check him out but everyone knows that grady under i'm just gonna call him grade grade really does like hates reaction channels like purely reaction channels and he hates them for like valid reasons in my opinion at least so he doesn't like so if you guys know what reaction channels are it's these channels who like put the who react to videos or viral trends that are on the internet right now and they put the video in the bottom left corner or right corner of their screen somewhere um, and they just watch the video react to it and then maybe they give their they talk about it once the video is done so the reason he doesn't like them is because um, he's saying that reaction channels put no effort into their video no, this is not me this is Grady's opinion so he said like um, I'm trying I'm, I don't know if this is exact words but this is pretty much what he said he does that they barely work. He said that reaction channels don't really work hard to make their videos and they get so much popularity and so much attention and everyone loves them but they don't do work on their videos and they, they get money from doing videos that they have no effort on which people say it's a good thing, right? But he says that the content that they produce is not high quality, it's not even entertaining and shouldn't be entertaining because all they're doing is just watching, you know, laughing at some points and they have the video playing. So he doesn't like it when when people don't really have um, a good reaction, like they don't really talk that much, and they include the, like the entire video, so he doesn't like reactionists, reactors. I don't, I don't even know what to call them. Can call them reactors. He doesn't like when people, like you know, when they put the video in the bottom left corner of the screen and they include the full entire video in its full length, and he doesn't like that when people have the full video in it because it's literally just. So it's big. It's basically saying that you got, you can watch my video with my reaction instead of watching the original video, getting that original person who worked hard for their for their to make their content, you know, just screw them, right? Because you can watch my video and watch the full video plus my reaction, and I get all the money. So he doesn't like that, and I pretty much agree with him in that part because um, I really don't like it when reactors like let's say I really. Let's say I made a video, let's say I made a pretty cool video that I worked hard on, it was a funny montage of whatever. So I made it, I worked hard on it, you know, I got some views, like, um, and I got some attention, people liked it, good. And, which, an, an, an awesome reactor, you know, um, decides to react to my video because it was pretty cool. So, you know, he downloads my video that I made, he puts it in the bottom left corner of the screen, he re reacts to the full entire video, he gets all the revenue from his video and not no, not nothing to me he, if he didn't ask permission even if he did ask permission I would probably want to ask to not include the entire video but let's say they didn't ask permission they just recorded it they they reacted to it put their thoughts I would not really like that because he's getting all the views and I, I don't care about money at all I just care that 
if someone did that to me, I wouldn't be as mad. I would just ask for permission. I would ask for permission and maybe just um, for them to link me in the description. But I still, I wouldn't like it if, if someone did that to you. Like, if you worked hard on a video you liked and someone just downloaded it, didn't ask for permission, uploaded the whole video, and they got more views than you. That's what the problem is. If they, if they get more views than you, they don't even have to watch my video, right? Because they can go on the reactor's video, plus their reaction, plus their thoughts, and all that stuff, which I totally agree with him. I don't like it how that's the case on YouTube, and YouTube is doing nothing about these reaction channels. It's basically totally against the fair use policy of YouTube. You can't download a full YouTube video, but you can um, use clips and a little bit of someone else's video, only if it's clips and it's not too much. That's totally under fair use and that's totally fine. So, it's so to recap, it's not good if a reactionist doesn't ask for permission, or a reactor, even if they do ask permission, if they include the full video and they react to it and they get all the revenue from it like it's not that's what i really don't like and that's what real that's why i think youtube should be more strict with people like like this whereas people who don't do anything because like youtube i don't think any reactor has gotten banned or flagged or anything but people who do nothing who do who are perfectly fine get their channels deleted for zero reason which is mind-balling for me like if i ever get deleted for maybe doing a, a tutorial on i don't know how to download music which is people do it all the time right and there are even bigger youtubers who do that if i get a copyright strike or whatever and they don't reactors don't because you know they uploaded the full video which surely gets fair use i would be totally pissed like just to say it bluntly but so f my tips for people who want to react so i don't want reactors just to stop because you know people some people still like that so my tips is um when you are reacting to a video do not upload please do not have the full entire video in in your reaction you can either um cut it in half which is good or do like the best parts of that video and react to it yourself or you can film yourself reacting to the full video but when you're actually editing it, don't include the full video. Cut out parts that are not as important. And make sure that when you're reacting to it, you're not silent at all. Because if people don't want to watch you reacting to a full video when you're literally doing, Haha, oh that's funny, the whole time, like, and that's all you're saying. That's totally against for use quality. It's not even entertaining. And you get so much views and attention for that, which requires no effort at all so i'm not trying to bash any reactors out there i'm just giving tips on my opinion and what i think you guys can improve so again please oh, always 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 ask for permission and make sure they say yes um and even if they say you can upload um the full video don't upload the full video don't react to the full video and don't include it in your reaction video your reaction video should have maybe at most only 50 percent of the original video at most so cut out parts that, are not, that you don't talk in um, and people who say you shouldn't talk during reaction that's the stupidest thing I've ever heard because if you don't talk you're just silent throughout the whole video what's the point of your reaction where you can just watch the original video so that's what I'm saying so have a really good reaction talk laugh and have a genuine reaction don't be silent don't include the whole video and when you give your thoughts make it long and actually people would want to watch your reaction make sure to always link and always um, link it in the description the original video and always uh, mention the original creator of the video um, if you can if you want to monetize it there's a way to and if they climb if they file a copyright claim um, and they get the revenue off it don't delete it because then none of you will get the revenue and if he wants the video to stay up let's say the original creator wants the video to stay up but wants to get the rev wants to file a copyright claim so that they get the revenue instead of them just let them have their deserved money because they made the video and you're just reacting to it so um i mean it doesn't it doesn't really matter but it just depends on the original creator everyone has their own opinions about their own content being reacted to honestly if my content was reacted to again i would feel the same way i would be pretty flattered right but just don't include the full video please and make sure to give permission because creators work hard for their videos and reactors just totally did like they say f you to the, to the fair use policy youtube doesn't care they get 100 percent of the intention and revenue from their video 
And it's really annoying when people barely have a reaction, when they're just literally saying, oh my god, oh that's so funny, like, within, and there's like a minute of silence. No, don't, that's just, that's just my opinion on this whole reaction channel thing. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave your opinions about whatever this thing is in the comments below. I'm sorry if I'm kind of out of focus, I'm just trying out this new cinema blurred background thing. Thank you so much for watching, hope you all enjoyed it, and I'll see you next video. Peace out everybody.